Hello everyone, this is Wen Hing. Today, let's make this quick and tasty spicy orange cauliflower bites that is great as an appetizer or a dish with a bowl of rice. So let's get started. The batter is simply a mixture of all-purpose flour or gluten-free one-to-one -one blend that you can season with salt and pepper or any other seasoning that you like. For the liquid, you can either use water or unsweetened non-dairy milk of your choice. The consistency of the batter that you're looking for should be similar to the pancake mix. You want a thick layer that stays nicely on the flour when you dredge them in it, so be sure you're able to coat it without much drippings. There are many ways to cook the cauliflower florets, and today I'm using the air fryer method. Please check my blog for instructions if you need to bake these instead. Preheat the air fryer using the fries setting and mine is 390 Fahrenheit. I didn't use any oil here and it took me about 8 to 10 minutes to crisp up. To make the sauce, simply add the oranges and I have about 3 fourth cup here along with the seasoning and bring it to a rolling boil. Feel free to saute some ginger with oil for the spice before this step if you prefer. You can always adjust the sweetness and saltiness of the sauce based on how you like it. Say if I get a sweet orange, I'll put less sugar and vice versa. Or if I want it more salty, I'll add some more soy sauce. It's as easy as that. And today, I'm also going oil free. To thicken the sauce, you can either cook it down or add some cornstarch slurry and either way works depending on how saucy you want it to be. Once all the ingredients are well combined and the sauce has thickened, add in the air fried cauliflower florets and quickly toss to coat them. This dish is best eaten right away as the cauliflower florets are still crispy, so enjoy them as soon as they're off the pan. I also garnish it with some chopped scallions and toasted sesame seeds before serving. Mmm, this smells so good and look at the sticky sauce. There you have it, spicy orange cauliflower bites is done. I hope you give this easy recipe a try and if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to click on the bell so you'll be first to know when a new video is up. Thanks for watching and have a beautiful day. Bye!